Hey guys, Jeff here with the Plugin Blog. Today we're taking a look at the Fluence AB40 Sound Bass. Now, this is the unit right here, and you can see it's got a fairly decent size to it. There's four three-inch drivers across the front of this, two one-inch silk dome tweeters, and overall, it's quite the nice little speaker. I was rather impressed in just how full of a sound and rich of a sound that it delivers for a relatively small space that it takes up. You can see it's only a couple of inches high. Um, there are some interesting claims that Fluence makes with this speaker, one of which that it can recreate surround sound. I, I guess if you were in a small confined space that was perfectly rectangular, these speakers might be able to do that for you. It wasn't really the experience that I had, but that being said, I have a full surround system in here with hardwired speakers that sit behind me, so it's really hard to break the mold of the physics of audio and do it with a single source. So it may not have had that effect for me, but that might not be the case if you have a smaller rectangular listening space, you might be able to see and hear that from this speaker. The other claim that Fluence makes is that this will reach down low, all the way to about 30 hertz, which really is about the same frequencies that subwoofers operate in. Again, it was a claim that I, I guess where they're coming from, there is some low end that's reproduced from this, but it's not at the same level with the same punch that you would get from a larger full sounding speaker or a subwoofer like I've got here. All in all though, the Fluence AB40 sounded really nice and it would be a major upgrade to any speaker system that is just in the back of a flat screen television. It sounds nice, it's musical, and I was rather impressed. It's Canadian made too, by the way, and uh, you can pick it up at Best Buy. Want to thank Best Buy for sending it my way so that I could uh, take a listen and tell you all about it. Check out the blog, and if you have any questions, please leave them for me at the bottom. Until next time, I'm Jeff. We'll see you then.